back to another episode of What's Cooking on here in Wake Up Ilocos. So for today, we are going to make grilled pesto prawns with aligue sauce. This is so easy to make, so let's get started with it. So first, we are going to heat our griller. Add tayo ng konting oil. Although this is a Teflon uh, grill pan I'm using, I'm still gonna put a little oil para hindi masunod yung pesto natin. So first, let's take this. Kasi imimix natin yung ating prawns sa ating pesto. So guys, this is our pesto. It's basically uh, basil with cashew nuts or pine nuts or any nuts that are available. Tapos uh, olive oil and garlic. So, it doesn't necessarily mean na pag sinabing pesto, eh, basil-based lang. Pesto is actually the process or the method of doing the, ano, the sauce. So, i-dip lang natin ng ating mga prawns dito sa pesto. And while minamarinate natin to, turn on our second pan. While make uh, while hinihintay natin mag-heat yung ating griller pan, gagawin na natin ang ating sauce. First, our onions. And garlic. Infuse lang natin to. And we're gonna add about 4 tablespoons of our alito. So this is a seasonal dish since we barely see naman yung alige sa grocery stores. Tapos, we're gonna add na our cream. Para i-neutralize lang yung um, flavor. So napakadali lang nitong gawin. Kumbaga eh, instant gourmet. Pepper. And salt. And a tablespoon of sugar. Yeah. Tapos, mix lang natin to until mag-simmer. After that, set aside natin and we're gonna grill na our pesto prawns. So, mainit na ang ating pan. Ready na tayong mag-grill ng ating pesto prawns. This would only take about 2 minutes to cook. So, season lang natin. Tapos, other side. So, this is almost done. Mas masarap ang, ano, prawns kapag hindi siya overcooked. So, watch nyo lang siya pag inuluto. So, this is 10 minutes or less uh, gourmet dish. Ayan. And this is done. Eat the plate na natin siya. You can serve this with rice. You can serve this with pasta. Actually, yung alige sauce natin, you can actually toss it to your pasta. And there you have it, guys. Another great recipe. Ito na ang ating grilled pesto prawns with alige sauce. So for more recipes and tips, join me again next time on another episode of What's Cooking only here on Wake Up Ilocos. Alright, so asarap naman nun, diba? It's a seafood of... It's a special dish na seafood lahat siya kasi it's alige and... Yeah, it's green really? pressed to prawns with alige sauce. Ah, sarap naman yun. Alam mo, hindi ako mahilig sa prawns at saka yung mga... Uh, Why? Para allergic kasi ako doon. Pero siguro pag natikman ko to, <laughs> mawawala lang. Sabi naman ako na allergic ko. ka naman daw. It's, it's <laughs> ano eh, um, hindi, maaaring hindi fresh yung seafood. Pero this one, parang grabe, so mouth-watering siya. Exactly. Kasi hindi mo talaga, it's seafood. Lahat mga seafood lovers yun, mga gusto special dish na ito. And I can't wait to visit that 
favorite restaurant kasi mm-hmm. parang bago bago yata to restaurant yes. so and i can't wait to you know taste that uh grilled breast prawns with alligator sauce yung alligator sauce talaga doon talaga ako nagki curious kung so tikman yung alligator sauce na yan <laughs> sabay tayo bro yeah <laughs> all right so moving on let's go to high tech high tech yes. We talk about high technology and yeah. this is it, Roxy, di ba? Yeah, yung iPod, we're in, ito yung isa sa pinakabagong unreleased ngayon ng Apple. We're in, it's it's much more modern than the iPod oh. that we have. Social talaga siya and very yeah. accessible siya. Din. Nung nahawakan ko siya, ayoko na siyang bitawan kasi sobrang ganda talaga ng gadget na ito. Though it's bulky, pero andun na eh, parang it's a computer na siya, tablet na talaga siya, sa PC tablet na siya. So, Kung curious kayo sa gadget na ito and you wanna know more about this, please watch this. Hello everyone and welcome to the weirdly lovable world of iTech where I'll be giving you a dose of tech-related series including updates about the latest in the software and hardware technology. Today we'll be featuring iPod. Yes, ang iPod is isa ngayon sa mga pinaka-famous na gadget dito sa buong world. And many celebrities and even mga gadget lovers out there is talagang grinab agad dito. It's because ano nga ba ang meron sa iPod na ito, right? Ito yung bago at ito yung pinaka-latest na in-introduce ngayon ng Apple. Tell us more about it, Martin. I'm here to introduce to you the latest gadget, the Apple iPad. Uh, this Apple iPad is released on the second quarter of 2010. The, the Apple iPad. Itong Apple iPad is approximately 9.7 inch display which is LED backlight. Meron na rin po siyang 16, 32, at 64 gig storage device. Ang maganda sa item na to is ang lasting ng battery niya is up to 10 hours. Imagine of 0.5 inch of thickness that will last for 10 hours. That's cool! At ang maganda sa item na to, is super sensitive na touchscreen niya. And you can also use the pinch zoom. Pinch zoom is what they call for the zoom of a photo or an image which is you're go- gonna do from your index finger and your thumb finger. When you put them apart, then it automatically goes zoom. When you shrink it, you only you have to do is to close your finger and the eye and the photo or image you're, you wish to shrink out is gonna turn to the size which you really wanted. This Apple iPad, ito ang bagong generation ng computer na sinasabi nila that even my mother can use sa sobrang dali gamitin ng item na to. This Apple iPad is also a computer. You can use this to type your word format, document for format, and a lot, lot more. Pwede ka na rin mag-photo edit sa sa iPad, you can play games and this item, pwede ka na rin maglaro ng mga digital games na may accelerometer features. The best tong item na to and if you techie geeks are looking for a good gift to yourself this Christmas, this is the best. Available to sa Widget City. We are located at Landmark Building, Vegan City. Available from 16GB, 32GB, up to 64GB. And if you buy until this Christmas, may libo kayong case and screen protect para sa pabon sa inyo ngayong Pasko. Or you can log in at our website at www.widgetcity.com.ph Our feature ID gadget for this week. Well, thank you po sa lahat naman nagsisend ng kanilang mga emails in regards with their problems sa kanilang gadgets and we all welcome that. Yes, and we have some questions here. Mark of Sina, it says that he can't defrag his computer. Well, Mark, try to download Glary Utilities and open the Modules tab. Then select Files and Folders, then Disk Analysis and scan the drive or partition. It will give you a complete list of all the data stored on the drive in each file or folder size. You might be able to find a folder that is saving a lot of data you were not aware of. Mm -hmm. And it helped me and others with the same problem because you know, in finding files or folders that can be deleted. It also has a lot of other great tools to help maintain your PC and it's free. On the other hand, well, Lisa of Kabuga wants to know if what type of cable is required for file transfer for one PC to another. Marami nagkaka problem ng ganito, diba? Lisa, if you're using the Easy Transfer Wizard in Windows, you can use this. HTTP, mm-mm, yes, that's www.amazon.com slash belkin dos transfer 
via samaban and cable or you can even just use a thumb drive or external hard drive if you have one around. Then copy the documents folder from one into the documents folder of the other. Well guys, I hope that I fixed your computer problems. For comments and suggestions, email us at wakeupilocos at yahoo.com to learn more and take on the world of gadgets only here in iTech. Till next episode guys, this has been your iTech Jock Roxy, shutting down.